how to embed Kartra pages into WordPress. Hey guys, JR Fisher here. And I know what you're thinking. You want to build your pages in Kartra, but you'd rather have them on your website, not in Kartra. Can you do that? Of course you can. It's simple and easy. And in this video, I'll show you how to do it in a snap. It'll be really easy. So stay with me and watch to the very end. Also at the end of this video, I've got a $97 course. You can get absolutely free, but for a limited time. So check the link below in the description section and you'll find that. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to do that. Hit that big subscribe button and turn on bell notifications. There's a little bell next to the subscribe button. If you click that and then turn on all notifications, every time I do a video, I can notify you and you won't be left out in the cold. You'll be part of the VIP family, the Fisher family, the VIP group that gets notified every single time I do one of these videos. Also put your comments below. Let me know what you think of this video. Let me know what you think of Kartra. What are you using? Do you have any hacks? I'd love to hear them. You got any questions, problems, put those in the comments below. Okay. Check it out. We're going to go over to Kartra right now. Are you ready for this? Let's get going right now and let's go over to the pages tab right here okay and it brought up all my pages here now i could take one of these pages and put it on my wordpress website but i think what i'm going to do so that we don't miss any of the steps is i'm actually going to build a page so i'm going to go right here and this big green box is on all of the different categories for kartra and that's just adding another item for that particular category whether it's pages whether it's products uh, whether it's communications that's how you do it so what do i want to do let's see here let's do a hmm, let's do a video sales page what do i like here i like this one here so i'm going to select that i'm going to launch builder and i'm going to call this video sales page all right in category guys category is so very important it helps you sort these later on and i know you think well i don't have that many pages i don't have to worry about categories believe me that will change now you see i have a choice of all these different categories here but what if i wanted a different category this is the cool thing right here Kartra will let you add categories on the fly so right here i'm going to put manage categories and just show you how to do this and i'm going to write uh, a new category here i'm going to put training oops training category okay so i'm going to add that and now what i can do is since it's been added it is right here training category obviously there's no pages i just made this one up i'm gonna click done right here and then i'm gonna select my category right here and there it is training category so i'm gonna put it in there site this is up to you i don't put a site in particular here i have several different sites so i'm gonna put no site in particular and i'm gonna click create now once i've created this page which i just did uh, i want to show you how to put it on your wordpress website so let's see here i'm going to right here i'm going to edit this video right here and I'm going to say I'm going to use a Kartra video. Uh, I'll use maybe Inner Circle. That'll be fine. Then I'll select a video. Uh, yeah, I like this one here. Bearded video. Let's pick that one right there. So I've got that. And you can see that video is now populated and I've applied it. Okay. Now, what I want to do here is I want to go ahead and save it. And I'm going to click Publish Live. Now, when I click Publish Live, it's going to give me some options. Now, if I wanted to just get the link to the page, I would go here, but I don't. I want to do something a little bit different. I want to actually get the page code, which is right here. So this is the page code. So what I want to do is I want to go over to WordPress now, and I want to add a new page, and I'm going to put uh, sales training video. Video right here, and I'm going to publish this page right here. I'll later on go back and just delete it but for our sample this is what we'll use now I can actually see the page right here so let's go ahead and take a look at the page and this is what it is so far okay so that's what the page looks like nothing there so I'm gonna go back and I want to get rid of all this because I want it to be a blank template so what I'm gonna do down here is I'm gonna pick this I'm gonna pick this right here and I'm gonna pick a blank slate right there and once I've done that, I need to update it. So I've got it updated. 
which is good, which gives me a blank slate. So let's go back and look at that page again. Okay, so this is what I wanted. I wanted a blank slate. I don't want anything on it. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in here and I'm going to launch my Thrive Architect. Now, depending on what you're using, you're going to have different ways of getting at your HTML code. With Thrive Architect, this is where I go right here. And I click right there. And it's loading a little bit slow. Okay, so this is the page. Now, in Thrive, there's all kinds of things I can do. When I click this plus symbol here, it brings up all these different options. I want to go down here where it says custom HTML. That's what I want. And I want to bring this over. And I'm going to insert my custom HTML right here. Now, I have to get this from Kartra. So I'm going to go over to here. And I'm going to get this page code right here. And then I'm going to go over here to my page where I need to paste it. And I'm going to put it in there. Okay. And I'm going to click save. Now you're not going to see a preview here. And the reason you're not going to see a preview is this is HTML code. This is not a preview of the actual page. So I want to click save work right here. It says all save, all, all changes save. So then I'm going to go back to right here and I'm going to click update and let's see what that page looks like. So I can now go here. It says page updated view page. So I'm going to click right here. And lo and behold, there's that page from Kartra right here. Now, I don't know what link they've automatically put in here. Let's click this. Okay, the link doesn't go anywhere right now. So what I want to do is I want to go back to Kartra and I want to change something on here so I can show you that it actually changes on the fly. So we're going to select this, this big button here and we're going to click edit. And I'm going to click the link part of it. Right now, the link doesn't go anywhere. Okay, so I'm going to put link to an external URL. I'll click this. And it'll give you an option right here to do it. So I'm going to send it to Google. And the cool thing about Kartra is when I make changes that are within Kartra on this page, it will automatically change to my WordPress website. I don't have to go back and, you know, re-add that code again. So it says it's making the changes. I'm going to go ahead and click save now, publish live. All righty. Now, what I can do is I go back to my WordPress website, which is right here. Okay. And let me go back one so I can get to that main part. Okay. Now, I shouldn't have to do anything here. I should just click on it and it should have made the change. So let's click. All right. There's that page again. Now let's, this is the button right here that I changed and I added a URL and that URL went to Google. So let's see if it actually goes to Google. Look at that. The link works and I didn't do anything in Kartra. It just automatically knew when I changed that page in Kartra that it would change that link, which changed all the code in there to make it go to a different place. So let's go back to Kartra here real quick. And let's just make one other little change in here. Um, and we're going to say, go text here. And we'll say, this is a great sales page. Exclamation point there. And then we're going to click publish live. And then I'm going to go back to my WordPress page here, which is actually right here. Okay, there's the WordPress page. And look at this. This is a great sales page. So you can see all of these changes that I'm making in Kartra will automatically change to my WordPress website. I won't have to go back and log in and make changes or do any of that stuff. And this page will always be uploaded, always be done. Don't have to worry about it. Now, I see a lot of this stuff across the top here because I'm logged in as an administrator to that WordPress website. That wouldn't be shown if I'm just going to this page. So that's basically all there is to it. It's super easy. Um, you can use this to you know, put any kind of pages or videos or you know whatever you want, opt-ins onto your WordPress website. It's super easy. Don't forget if you're just doing this as samples to go back and you know, get rid of those pages because that is something I want to do. So I'm just going to go in here and get rid of this page real quick. And what is the name of this page here? Sales training video. So I'm just going to go to my pages right here. And then I'm going to search sales training 
to try to find that page. Okay, there it is, sales training video. It's the one I just did six minutes ago. I'm gonna click on it here. I'm gonna go up to bulk actions and I'm going to move to trash. Get rid of that page. And then I will apply. And that page should be gone. And it is. And I wanna go back to Kartra and get rid of the one in here that I don't want. Okay, and this is the one I just created. So I'm gonna go back to the Kartra homepage and then I will go back to pages. Okay, here's the one I wanna get rid of right here. So I'm gonna click here and I'm going to delete that page. And that's deleted. And that's really all there is to it. It's super easy. You don't have to know programming. You don't have to know coding or any of that stuff. Kartra makes all this so easy. Um, don't forget to use my link below and check out Kartra. Okay, guys. So that's how you do it. It's really a simple process. It's just grabbing a line of script. Um, so if you want to have some of these pages on your website, you want to send them to your website for whatever reason, it doesn't matter. Um, they will see that page that is in Kartra. You don't have to keep changing that script every time you make a change to your Kartra page. It's an automatic change because that script code just goes back to the Kartra code and it knows what to do. I don't know how smart people came up with that, but it seems to work pretty well. So if you have any questions, please put them in the comment section below. This is a pretty simple process, but I know when you get in there and you start changing codes and HTML and all those fancy things, it can get a little overwhelming. I know it does for me. So put those comments below, put those questions below. Give me a thumbs up if you don't mind or thumbs down. If you don't like it, that would be a shame. But if that's what it is, that's what it is. At least give me some reaction. Don't forget. I've got a $97 course, $97, but it's free. Why not get it? It's below right there and below. And if you don't have Kartra also, there's a link for Kartra. You'll want to click on that Kartra link because it's my affiliate link. But what it'll do is it'll take you to a video and you can watch all the other things Kartra does. Kartra does some amazing stuff. You can go there. You can also sign up if you want. I mean, it costs nothing to watch the video, but if you decide you like the video and you like what it does, you can click and get a free trial for only $1, $1, pretty cheap. Okay. So check that out too. Don't forget. And don't forget to subscribe. Hit that subscribe button below here. Click the bell, turn on all bell notifications, 100% of all bell notifications. And it'll put you in the VIP group, the Fisher family. And that way you're notified every single time I do a new video. I thank you so much for watching this. Like I say, this is your channel. So if you've got questions, other things you want to learn, put that in the comment section below, and maybe I'll do a video on that too. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Hey, thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell right here so you can be notified every time I do a new video. Also click on one of those videos there. Keep watching on my channel.